Well, summer's last to rock. Continuing this week, we've got another day in the 80s for your Tuesday. Sunny and warm. Could see a little bit of fog in the morning out the door, but I'm not expecting widespread school delays or travel issues. High temperatures surging to the middle 80s. Right now, we are actually in the upper 80s, and if that Putnam County thermometer is correct, 91 degrees, boy, that would be near record heat for early October. Along the lakefront, though, a bit of a different story. Temperatures are in the 70s due to that lake breeze coming in out of the east northeast. Temperatures across the region are unusually mild, even up towards Grand Rapids and Saginaw. We're in the 80s. Minneapolis is at 87 degrees, near record warmth for the Twin Cities as we look towards early October weather. Sunny and warm for your Tuesday, 85 degrees expected. The winds are going to shift a little bit. It'll be a light breeze, but coming in out of the south versus that east northeast wind direction. Planning out your Tuesday could see a little bit of fog at daybreak. Again, not expecting it to be quite is dense or widespread. Lunchtime sunshine in upper 70s after school sports with the kids. Make sure they're staying hydrated because mid 80s certainly warm for this time of year. Here's a look at the next couple of days. Wednesday is going to be the last sunny and warm day of the stretch before some big changes arrive late week. Thursday, Friday will bring us some rain showers followed by an abrupt and sharp cool down. Sunshine continues through Wednesday. We're going to be watching this weather disturbance off to the west of us. That'll bring us showers by Thursday. You'll start to see an increase in cloud cover. Thursday is going to be a bit more gray in the sky, and this front is going to usher in rain chances, maybe a couple thunderstorms, but the biggest impact impact of that front is going to be the drop in temperatures, a chilly northwest breeze developing by late week and a taste of October with temperatures struggling to hit 60 and overnight lows are going to be in the 40s. The long range weather outlook features chilly conditions. This weather map goes from October 7th all the way through the 11th and temperatures are going to be below average with high temperatures near the 60 degree mark. With those fall temperatures, you're also going to start to see some fall color. We're still about two to three weeks away from the peak of fall foliage and it's going to start to feel like October. That change in the weather comes late week. 60s Friday, upper 50s for highs on Saturday. Sunday also is going to be chilly into next week. We keep the sunshine around. Temperatures will be in the mid 60s, a bit more seasonable for what you would expect in October. After these 80s, it'll certainly feel a little more like that pumpkin patch and apple orchard weather by the end of the 10 day forecast. Then we can get rolling. We can get with the hot apple yep. cider, the you pumpkins. You can have that sweater on, you know, yes. all the fixings for those there's fall fest. You need to be able to take your Instagram pictures with your flannel in your boots. I know. This is true. All the all the flannel. <laughs> if you were in a t-shirt, back in the grunge. Post that. Back in the grunge days. <laughs> it's all back in pop popularity now, mm -hmm. right?